wow. I'm surprised. And the best part is you can walk up all the way through. Yeah, just... that's. I'm surprised. I do wonder how much excitement there was for Joel, the like, first metro part. That's right, let people off first. Okay, let's go. To find the USB port. Please stand clear. Doors closing. <laughs> and to see how stable the chain is. <laughs> oh, <Please> gravity! <laughs> the next stop is I'm gonna go. I don't think I'll find a USB port today. Or at least on this train anyway. So as you can see, the uh, front of the train is actually pretty full because everyone wants to see the view from the front. If I was on the Sky Train in Vancouver, in uh, some of the trains, there's actually a seat at the front. And if you're lucky, you can sit on that seat or the first couple of seats and you can actually get a really good view of the tracks ahead. Sorry, I'm puffed. I just ran through the train to try and get to the front. So today every man and his dog is going to be on this although it's a little bit, um, um, it wasn't as crowded as I thought it would be, especially in the second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, however many, many carriages there were today. Um, but on my way back, um, I hope to find the USB charging port at the front and also to know if there's any windscreen wipers. You're probably wondering why I'm asking this question. It's because um, even though it's a man, um, sorry, a automated train with a, and it's driverless, if they have to put it into manual mode for any reason and it's raining, um, they will need the windscreen wipers at the front carriage, at the back carriage. Oh, first stop, crow's nest. Okay. Oh dear. Why the back is empty? That's actually, I I'm show you the indicator. So, I can't see now. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> so nobody wanted to go on the city train this morning. <laughs> um, taking this seriously, I am doing this test run soon because I have a, a couple of appointments this afternoon and one is from the north to the east and uh, I previously mentioned in my video that there's no direct route between the north and the east anymore because the bus 200 has been cancelled. 
so uh, the only way to get to the eastern suburbs now is to catch the metro into Martin Place and then walk across to the normal eastern suburbs line. Which should be quicker than actually taking the city train and changing at Town Hall onto the eastern suburbs line. That train takes forever. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll do another video later on.